I'm Jonathan Worsley here, and I'm with the Chief Executive Officer of the Red Sea Development Company, John Pagano. John, great to have you with us. And I wanted to ask you, why are you here at the Future Hospitality Summit? I'm here at the, the Future Hospitality Summit because I think the future of hospitality is actually being created right here in Saudi Arabia. Um, I, I, what's happening is on a scale that has never occurred before and I think unlikely to occur in the future. I mean, no country has ever transformed from almost a standing start to trying to create a hospitality and a tourism industry that's going to cater for upwards of 100 million visitors a year. Um, and this has been a successful gathering. I mean, we've brought all the best brands and people interested in seeing where Saudi Arabia is going. And so that's why we're here. We're here to, to really pass our message along, share the good news of all of our progress and really you know, give back to our, our local uh, constituents who are so excited to see what's going to come. Back to the local community. Uh, so exciting. And you were just on a panel with Dury and Zarello. So what was one of the, what was the one big takeaway from your panel? Well, the big takeaway for, from the panel for, uh, for me, and, and again, you'll, you'll have heard this from me before, it's about how we as an industry have to really start to challenge the business as usual model. We can't continue to do things the way we always have because the world is facing an ecological and an environmental crisis. And uh, so that's a big part of what I take away from this thing. I want to be able to promote the message that we at the Red Sea are actually leading the way, not just domestically, not just regionally, but actually globally, showing them that there's a better way to deliver tourism and hospitality um, with due regard to the to the environment. The environment is our planet. That's what we yeah. live in. And so for me, that's the biggest uh, the biggest single message that I, so I take from in, this. So in your words, the future ho of hospitality is really showing leadership on, on how to develop the hospitality industry. Well, absolutely. Look, hospitality and tourism really is cuts across so many different verticals from an industrial point of view. You know, you name it. I mean, not just the pure hotel side of things, but it's the food side, it's the logistics, it's transport, it's energy. And so it's right that we as an industry lead this transition away from the old way of doing things. And so that's the big part of what uh, you know our message is. We can do things differently. You just have to have the will to do it. And we're trying to demonstrate that you can do it. And that's what uh, we're very proud of. Yeah, very exciting. Well, John, thank you so much for joining us here at the Future Hospitality Summit. And uh, look forward to watching your journey with so much interest because it's so exciting. Well, maybe the next time we do this, we do it at the Red Sea. And just a little over a year from now, we're going to open our first I resort. I would love to do that. All right, it's on. All right, take care. <laughs> okay, thanks, John.